But what what did your man say? What was his plan if the shit goes down? That his four grand turns into two grand. What what was his plan then? Oh no, he's talking about his four grand gonna turn into a hundred grand. He said if it get the fifty cent with the shares he gonna have, he said he he'd probably make about a hundred. Right, but if if was a spliff, we'd all be high. That's a big ass if. So that's what I'm saying. Like on what basis? On what basis is he is he you know basing that if? Yeah, because the, the, he said the millionaires, and he he said uh, some somebody else, another name. He said and they, he said they was pushing for it to get accepted, and they um like promoting it, and they they like backing it and giving it the thumbs up. Yeah, well, look, man. I mean, I'm sorry to bust your bubble, but this is my opinion, right? Like I, I you know, I, I base this off my own research, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the caveat out there that it's my opinion. Man, Dogecoin is some bullshit. <laughs> But Dogecoin is like some Fugazi shit. It's like if somebody put, you know, a, a VVS diamond in front of you, you know what I mean? Like, you know, toe blue, clear, no flaws. And then they put this other Dogecoin diamond next to it. Dogecoin is that Fugazi ass, cloudy ass, cubic zirconium shit. You know what I'm saying? And the only reason why it's even pumped right now is just because people are like hyping it and pumping it up. Uh, and, and a good, you know, good thing that I told, um, I told somebody else this. Like, cause they're like, yeah, Elon Musk, you know, he, he's, you know, he's tweeting about it. This, yeah, that, the Elon third. Musk. Yeah, that's where he's talking about. Yeah, right. But look, he, that shit is a toy to him. He, Elon Musk, he bought some Dogecoin for his kid so his kid could play with Bitcoin. I mean, uh, play with crypto. The, the shit that Elon Musk is behind, don't look at his tweets, look at his money. He spent $1.5 billion on Bitcoin. He bought a little sprinkle. He spent some pocket change on some Dogecoin and gave it to his kid. So, like, I mean, that tells you right there, like, you know, what's up with that? You know what I mean? You got to follow the money. Um, but the thing of it is, Dogecoin, it's useful in that because so many are, like, gambling with it. You know what I'm saying? They're, like, playing with it. Like, it's going up and it's going down. Now, if you ride the wave, you can make a little bit of money, you know, riding the wave. But that ain't some shit that you're just going to buy and then, like, hold on to it for 20 years and think 20 years, you know, you're going to retire off your Dogecoin investment. You know what I'm saying? Nah, it's like so, it's like so, that. yeah it's like something that's popping right now you know what i'm saying like it's popping because because people are talking about it and it's in the news but when the hype goes down like you know every is going to be on to the next basically i mean that's my oh, opinion. No. see the main thing he, the way he was talking about he was just holding on he said till december he was like wait until like december and then see how it goes and that's just pretty much he wasn't talking about holding on in the long term unless it really explodes but he said he could still sell it off and you know make your money back that you will at least invested in it, and then you know it is what it is. Yeah, and but that it might was work. only to the end of the year type. Thing. Right. Yeah. It's yeah, only yeah. to the end of the year type thing. Yeah, that 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 might that might could work. That might could work. Um, and I'm 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 actually you know going to talk about like because there's a like there's once you look at these sites, man, there's like a a million. That's 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 just going too far. I'm, I'm you know stretching it but there's a gang there's a gang of coins that people you know got out there um yeah. and the crazy shit is it really doesn't take a lot to make a coin you know what i'm saying like i'm gonna I'm show this example where you can make a, you can make a brand new coin in two minutes it's easy to make a coin so there's a lot of bullshit coins out there so people have to be careful um but the doge coin when it first got started it was started as a joke somebody this, this dude he said, but he said it like caught on a little bit yeah, it, it, it did. It did a little bit. But I mean, I, I guess you got to put it in the context. Like, so um, the market cap or like, you know, what all of the Dogecoin is all, is all worth is worth seven billion dollars. That's, yeah. that's a lot of fucking money. You know what I'm saying? That's not that's not nothing to sneeze at. You know what I'm saying? And so so it is worth something. But when you look at it compared to Bitcoin, Bitcoin is worth one point one five trillion dollars. Dogecoin is worth seven billion. So that's that shit is like it ain't even in the same ballpark. You know what I'm saying? Um, which is why, you know, Bitcoin is more of a safer play than Dogecoin. Dogecoin is like, you know, some fly by night is popping, you know, it's popping right now. Next year, it ain't going to be popping. It's going to be like, you know, on to the next type of shit. Um, and I'm not saying it's going to go to zero or anything like that. But again, you know, there's, there's some, there's some aspects of it structurally that make it so that it probably is never going to be worth a whole, you know, it's, probably, it's never going to blow up. And he was like, uh...